guys, we're trying something new today. This is what the entertainment industry calls a pilot. We're really excited to show you what we made, so hit us up with your feedback and let us know if you want to see more. Enjoy! She says she's brave enough. I can do it. Ah. Oh! <laughs> like booger, spoiled milk, and barf, Jelly Belly with their Bean Boozle game have pushed the limits of what the human taste buds should be subjected to. And in the process, creating an internet phenomenon where everyone's just playing this Bean Boozled game on YouTube. Hey Courtney, have you seen my ID? I'm uh, no, it. but no. put this in your mouth. Oh, okay. Eh! Eh! Is that actual vomit? I don't know, let's find out. What? Our motion sickness and refuse. Look at those big boys! They got their own entire street. One jelly belly lane. America! Jelly beans! We traveled far and wide to get here, the Jelly Belly Factory, to find out how they get barf in jelly beans. It doesn't make sense. It's not safe. It shouldn't be healthy. But we're going to do it. In the meantime, we're also going to play some Bean Boozled, apparently with the CEO of the company. And then, if things get rough, I stole a bunch of barf bags from the aircraft. Let's go. Ah. Ooh, jelly bean, jelly bean. Stick my hand in there. Dude, there's gotta be at least 20 jelly beans. <laughs> no! Yeah! He called JB Kid. Hello! Hey! You welcome must be to Lisa. Jelly Billy! Thank you! Nice to see you, Courtney. Nice to see you, too. You're in for some fun today. Yeah, I guess so. Are you uh, daring? Yes, but there's some things I want to find out today about how you got these flavors in here, so I'm excited. Well, this is our lab, and this is where all of our flavor creations start. We're going to show you where it all starts. We have some concentrated flavors for you to smell today. It's an experience. It's aroma as well. And so here you're going to get to smell what some of these flavors smell like. So you've been here a really long time. Bean Boozle started in like 2007. Yes. So why did you make it? Like, it's gross. It is gross. Yeah. I can still smell some of those. Yeah. Huh? It's pretty crazy. It was inspired by Harry Potter beans, which we made for that movie. And then yeah. later, you know, the more we thought about it, it was like, this product has a sense of humor and it, it's engaging mm -hmm. and interactive. And, and the idea came up, what about a game? What if we take 10 great tasting flavors and 10 look-alike, nasty-tasting so flavors and combine them and make a game out of it. And trick ya! So that's how this started. Okay, so this is how it starts with these putrid shots of death. What are these? Do I have to guess? So we are gonna guess, and you know what? I am gonna guess with you. They're just labeled with A, B, C, and D. So here's how we're gonna do it. We're oh gonna gosh. open it up and then kind of wave the flavor towards you like this. Oh, I smell it already. Ugh. Oh, oh God, how do you do that? You are very, you've been at this a long time. <laughs> okay. Oh no. So, <laughs> this is so bad. <laughs> so let me give you a hint. Is, is it rotten egg? Yes. Okay, so this one. Oh, oh. oh God. And in this stage, it's a little different because you don't have the color of the bean to kind of guide you. Oh, yeah, because so, those are kind of the same color, give or take. So, <laughs> how we did this, mm -hmm. we actually took some sweaty gym socks. We put oh, them in a plastic yeah. bag and put them in somebody's trunk for a few weeks. Yes, that is stinky sock flavor. What? <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh! ah. This one's not so bad. Yeah, this one smells like... This one's door. <sighs> Just kidding. It's bad. <laughs> so I think this one might be cut grass. You are Maybe. correct. Yay! Okay, I definitely got the one right. Okay, cool. So we're narrowing them down okay, cool. here. D. Ah! Oh, God! Ah! 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 So bad. I don't know what the no! word means for this. 
Oh, it's like a punch to the stomach. Sensitive, it, it is. And if you drink this in real life, oh. it's pretty oh. nasty. So it is spoiled milk. This is the worst one. <laughs> Pretty bad, oh. huh? I have a lot more questions, but uh, should we just begin the tour? I really want to see more as well. Sure. Okay. Let's go out and see how we make these beans. So we're going to take you on up to the kitchen first, okay. where it all starts. Welcome to the kitchen. So here we are in the kitchen, and this is where we begin making the center of the Jelly Belly beans. We have a state-of-the-art computerized system that actually holds all of our recipes. We start out with a base, a slurry we call it, that's water, sugar, cornstarch, and corn syrup, and we mix those all together. And then to those, we add the special ingredients that make each flavor taste just like what it is. Like if it's peach, we add real peach puree, or if it's pear, we add juicy pear. And in this case, if it's bean boozle and we're making booger, we add our special ingredients that make it booger flavor. Oh, cool. And the same thing with the other crazy flavors as well. Wow. And this is where we add flavorings and colorings and other ingredients to make each bean the unique flavor that it is. How are you feeling? It's a little, it's a lot of smells. Yeah, you feel a little sick? <laughs> a little bit. I got my puke bag. So we're we've good. added in all the special ingredients that make spoiled milk spoiled milk. And that is now dropping downstairs through the floor to go to our department that actually shapes all of these into a Jelly Belly shape. We got to get you out of here. You look like you're about ready to lose it. Ah! Yeah, I, shouldn't, no. I shouldn't push that. No, let's not push that. Okay. <laughs> Oh, it's like good. 
good, but then it's like bad. So this is the center of the dead fish. And in here, we're going to pan, which smells very potent. And we're going to build up the shell on the outside of this. Want to whip? No. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's pretty bad. I feel like I'm inside a whale. Well, you, you know, if it's canned tuna. <laughs> Just wait till that shell gets on there. Oh, oh. oh. That's not canned oh, oh. That is not canned tuna. <laughs> How could something so pretty and pink yeah. smell so hideous? Do you like it? <laughs> My eyes are burning. So now they're all spinning and panning, and the smelly shell is being put on right now. It smells like way worse. Get out of here. All right, let's get let's out go. of here. Let's go. Let's go. It's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. This is just the regular. Yeah, this is just a regular. It looks like uh, 49 assorted flavor mix. And these are getting ready to be packaged into this machine over here. My favorite flavor from here is the, the bright fire engine red. Wow, what is that one called again? This is red apple. I love my red apple. absolute favorite. Ah! <laughs> you got it. <laughs> What's the single most popular flavor of Jelly Belly? Berry cherry. Berry cherry? Berry cherry forever. The only time it had ever been passed up is by the number two flavor, buttered popcorn, for a very short time. So is that cool or what? I don't even know how to explain it. This is unreal. We call it the sea of beans. <laughs> this is all candy that's waiting to go into packaging and get the Jelly Belly logo stamped on every bean. Oh, wow. That way you know it's the true thing. So you now you've seen how we make it. Do you want to go play a game of Bean Boozle? Let's do it. Okay, my mind is blown right now. The, the, I never knew that it was so complicated, just the entire process of making a tiny little guy. You're ready to try? Yeah, I guess Are I'm, you daring? I'm going against the master, I feel like. <laughs> okay, so we'll play Bean Boozled, and then we'll answer some questions with the fans. Oh, okay, it says dare to compare. Okay, so you wanna spin? Yeah. Eh. Hey, that was pretty good. Rotten egg? Oh. Or butter popcorn? Whew. One of my most hated, and you picked it first. I'm sorry. Hey, at least we're getting out of the way. Okay, so you're gonna pick this one right here. The blotchy one? Yes, the blotchy that, yellow guy? That yellow one, and I'm gonna pick this one. The first question was how just how disgusting can you make the jelly beans or are you allowed to make? Well, they're absolutely disgusting. Yeah. And so all of them pretty much when you think of canned dog food. Uh, and rotten egg, bar. That is booger, pre that is pretty much as bad wax. as it gets. I mean, yeah, they're pretty nasty. Yeah. So cheers. Okay. Oh god. Yes, I got butter popcorn. It is rotten egg, but I okay, can handle so. it. Okay. So, all right, do you want to spin this time? Sure. Okay, here we go. Uh, we'll just say that's Juicy Pear or Booger. Perfect! Pear I'm excited for both. Okay, so the next one's actually a really serious question um, from a fan. Do you guys know Willy Wonka? I actually don't know him personally, but I love Gene Wilder in the movie. <laughs> he was awesome. Your factory looks like it yeah. a little bit, especially in the original movie when it's like the crazy invention yes, room. Exactly. It looks like that. I love your rodeo guy. Okay, here goes Booger. Ching! I got Booger. I think I got Juicy Pear. <laughs> I lucked out. It's time to tell me. I think it's time for me. I think I've earned my place here. Um, how do you get the barf into the jelly bean? Okay, well, I actually have to clarify there. Well, at Jelly Billy, we always try to make all of our beans with natural ingredients whenever possible to get that true to life punch of flavor. Mm -hmm. That's in our good tasting flavors. Mm -hmm. In flavors like Bean Boozled, I promise we only use artificial ingredients to get that taste and those flavors that you don't really want to taste. Mm -hmm. And when it comes to barf, there's a story behind barf and how that came to be. Mm -hmm. And it's actually something that happened to us that was a mistake. Um, when we were asked to make a product called cheese pizza, and we mixed together three cheeses, which happened to be 
really stinky cheeses. <sighs> and when we did that, it turned out absolutely atrocious. And we were like, forget that, put that on the show. We just can't even handle that. And then when the movie Harry Potter came out, they asked us, hey, would you please make these vomit beans back then they called them. And one of our employees remembered, hey, Remember that disgusting flavor we made that really tastes like barf? You know, when you get that really stinky, nasty cheese? That's what it tasted like. So we pulled that recipe out and that is how we came up with the barf bean. Well, so sucks. are you brave enough? Well, hopefully I actually get a barf one. She says she's brave enough. I do, I do, I can do it. Ah. Oh! <laughs> Tastes like putrid cheese and acid. Oh, that's pretty gross, huh? Uh, I just I have some suggestions for uh oh some flavors. Burnt toast. Burnt toast. That's a great idea. We actually had buttered toast previously. Really? As a good flavor, but burnt toast. Yeah, I like that. Cause that could be good or bad. Yeah. Uh, soap. We have soap. You have soap? Yeah. Wait, you guys like We selling? actually had soap. Dude, I, it's like when I was a kid, so, I swore. My yeah, mom... so you're in trouble? Wash your mouth out with soap. <laughs> yeah. Say, I'll my take kids a bean, trouble. mom, instead. Yeah. yeah, if my kids get in trouble, <laughs> I'll just have soap jelly beans. That's, I'm an innovator, you know? You are. You can hire me. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. What are you getting there? Oh, I taste the cheese. I taste the toothpaste. Oh. It's just getting worse. There's a dog. I don't think I've ever seen anybody do that. Thank you for having me and for this free meal. Um, and I really appreciate you taking me on this tour. And people can just come here and take the tour too, right? Yes. That's so Nine cool. to four every day, free. That's so exciting. Free! Yo! Free and, tour. And I got a free, free lunch samples. and a free tour. And I'm happy with my discovery. And thank you for taking me on this journey. So great to have you here. You are one brave lady. I don't think, oh God. <laughs> Thanks guys for watching. Bye. Well, we did it. We figured out the source of the barf jelly bean. I can't believe it was a freaking accident. It's probably one of the best accidents that could have ever happened. Post in the comments where else you want us to go and what else you want to see made. There's so many things that we don't know about. Yeah, I'll see you on the next one. Goodbye. He said, he said I could. This is my car, right? <laughs>